Hey everybody, welcome. This is Taxi Life, and we're getting ready to pick up a Sonia Schultz. I appreciate everyone's continued support for these videos, and if I am correct, this should be her. Let's take a look at her. Oh yeah. That's why I took this task. She's not gonna, it's not gonna be hard to get in her pants. It's not easy, We're right in the middle. Just how I like it. And there she is. Hi there. Hi, how you doing, Miss Sonia? I once knew a Sonia, her last name was Blade. Yeah, we didn't get along. She went and fought for some tournament. Wasn't having it. So we broke it off. So anyway. Where am I taking you? You're going to be quiet like all the others. All right, once we get out of here, we're going to speed it up. We're not going grandpa mode. So, you're enjoying my new vehicle. This is a electric, one of those electric jobs. You got to charge it. And I mean by electricity and MasterCard. It costs a lot. Alright, we are right up here. I'm guessing we're gonna be taking a, a lefty Lucy or a righty tighty. Yep, righty tight. I'd rather a righty tidy than a tidy whitey. No thank you. I'm good on that. I'm more of a boxer, man. Not sure why you needed to know that, but if I had to wear them, I'm going boxers, which <laughs> I don't go without. Didn't your mother ever teach you always wear clean underwear? Oh, hit the curve. Must be true. Alright. Here we go. Right up here. Don't want to run no lights. And I'm popo -po via around. Can't afford another ticket. Or another stint in the prison. These Barcelona prisons are not exactly a five star hotel. I've done a stint or two here. I've had manslaughter charges from hitting these pedestrians that just feel they want to walk across the street and feel the hood of my car. Why is it my fault? You want to feel the windshield and hood. Why am I on the hook? I only did a service for them. Oh, they're out early picking up the garbage. Yep. <clears throat> Good old-fashioned hard work going on out here. We're at 3.30 in the morning. Can't imagine where you're possibly going. Like, it can't be work. What work opens at 3.30 in the morning? They would turn here. Very good. So far, a nice uneventful trip. Not much to gawk at. Like, is this the one way, or do I have to go this way? I think I'll go this way. And play it by American rules. I'm still getting to know this city. 
And I got something in my eye. <sighs> oh, almost. Wait, do you stop here for the light or up there? Obviously here, because you can't see it change up there. Durr. Durr. You might want to learn how to drive before you start taking Uber jobs. And I don't mean like a lot of jobs. I mean driving Uber. Alright. Almost there. I mean, damn, I just got to know you. It said you were medium, but I still feel like I haven't got any closer to getting your genes off. Maybe they should have called this one hard. Well, also because of my status waist down. So that'll be two reasons this was hard. All right, we're right around the corner. Sonia Schlutz. <laughs> Anybody ever pick on you in high school and call you Sonia Putz? Wait, I have a red light. Almost ran right into that one. Try explaining that to the insurance company. <laughs> Why don't you just put lights facing us across the street? Why are they on in the corner? I'm stopping. Like this. Can we get these lights closer to those buildings in front of us? Just say. Just say. Alright, Sonia Schlutt. You better fork out some cash. Seems I went the wrong way. Well, we could fix that easy. <clears throat> I'll just make a loop-de-loop -loop here and go up the wrong way. The American way. It's the only way we do it. Us ignorant Americans doing things our way, creating our own paths in life. What is a law? It's not like it's a commandment. It's something man-made. Okay. Are you you're... trying to kill us? <laughs> Why? Because I smoke a lot? I'm trying to maybe you live a little longer. I'm not trying to exactly manslaughter thanks for the ride <laughs> you ain't got the ride yet hopefully you call me again and i could give you that ride this was just the drive okay so oh damn you can't really spin through speed through these little skinny streets. <clears throat> there it is. Yes. I see daylight. No, really, I do. The moon's about to go to sleep. It's had its 12 hours for the night. Work night shift time to go get your rest. Let the sun take it from here. Wish it was a woman's ass rather than a moon. Alright. <clears throat> right up here is our first accident. I think there's a couple or it was just a really bad one. Uh, it, it was worth investigating. Okay, let's see some action.
What, you're waving for me to go that way? Or did you just fart? I think you farted. Bruh. <laughs> that dude's stinking it up. These people have enough to worry about. Oh, jeez. Look at this. <laughs> Who do you think she's talking about? He got sexted when he was driving and the wife's like, you son of a, I saw your phone, you son of, you're getting out, I'm going to my mother's, you son of a, you worthless bastard, and these poor people just got in it, because of that dude doing his sex life, look at, that's a good woman, she's rubbing his back, it's okay baby, we'll get another car, I know we're living paycheck to paycheck, but we can do it. We've always made things work. And we're going to sue the piss out of them. Oh yeah, somebody's getting a payday. And she's just trying to look all sexy for some reason. <laughs> you already got the lawyer on the scene. Greedy ass heard about it. It's like, we're ready to make you money. Yeah, oh, that was an interesting thing. No medics were involved. Hmm, wonder what else we can see in this city. Alright, we got on our radar. Hey. Or, I'ma play like I heard it on the... Oh, wait. Dang, I'm gonna act like I heard it on the CB. Yeah, they got a, another accident. We're gonna go check it out. This one's gonna be quite a distance. I'm not paying attention to the road. Alright, let's go. I don't know why there's nobody that needs rides. Everyone probably heard about my cab by this point and like, don't call this dude. Alright, right up here. We get past this. And daylight is coming out. The sun's yawning at this point. <sighs> okay, let's wake these people up. Alright, let me give you some of my sunshine. Alright, it can't be that much further. I know I'm going to have to make like a U-turn at the end, according to the route. Oh, that dude, I, it would have ended it for him. Okay, this is the end of the line, so this must be it. And I wonder what that cup is. I'm curious about what that cup does. It's like a trophy or something. Didn't light up nothing. Nothing unusual to report. Except for me. And my bad driving. Oh, well, they probably cleaned that rack up by now. I feel like I drove across all Barcelona. Hey, here it is. Oh, that is crap. The last wreck was better. 
at least I get to see this guy talk about how his life's basically over. And his mom's going to kick him out the basement for wrecking the family car. Uh, actually, I looked like that this morning when I was taking a deuce. I was just like thinking about all the things I ate and what it could have been. Why I'm saying, oh God, never again. Yeah, I don't think that's his situation. Alright, y'all. Hey, that's it for today. I did pretty good. I picked up one chick. This whole city apparently doesn't need a ride anymore. I've run out of people to pick up, oddly enough. Or I have to switch cars. Some of these people might not like EVs and want a gas car. But I'm pretty sure this game doesn't end that I know of, but who knows. When you play it in VR, it's not really a game. It just, it's so real, it's so bigger than life, like you just can't really grasp what the UI and stuff is just so much in VR it's like you're really literally driving around and if anybody has access to VR PC and a PC definitely get this and mod it this is a given but you gotta have the steering wheel. It's the whole thing. If you just happen to have all that, excellent. But if you're gonna play with a controller, I don't know. It's gonna take away from the whole immersion. You can't feel all the bumps when you hit these things. I mean, it's just fun to even steer the wheel like things you can't do in real life it's not like a truck simulator later game where it just doesn't it feels real but not like this this is a different level of driving simulation this could actually pass as a tutorial on how to drive you know anybody that needs to learn how to drive just sit them behind this about 30 40 hours she they'd be a master at the road but anyway we hit daylight and i appreciate y'all's continued support on these videos i hope i haven't disappointed but Either way, I had fun, and I hope a few of you did, too. So y'all go ahead and take care, and maybe next time people will, will need a ride. Because I'm telling you, like, my map is empty. There's, like, nobody. It's a ghost town. Less people are Ubering and more people are buying their own vehicles. Times have changed in the Uber market. I'm looking all around. I see one person and they're like right here. I don't know. Margarita. Yeah, you talked me into it. Damn it. Somebody's desperate enough for a ride, so you damn right I'ma um give them a ride. Where are we going? I'll just do it this way until I get there. <clears throat> Excuse me, I got somewhere else to get.
somebody actually taking a chance. They must have been super desperate to take me as a driver. I was about to call it. That was a good call. Ooh, the sun is bright. You are just cooking the right left side of my freaking face. Thank God for that building. Okay, we're gonna just go ahead and... Oh, we should have went down there. Oh! All right. All right, right here. Look at it. Looks like a duo. Two people. Let's just go ahead and get across here. Shh. Uh-oh. What am I going around for? Rules are for schmucks. Alright. Let's get our game face on. Well, that's not my game face. That's a map. Okay. We say game face. We give them game face. Or lame face. Oh. God, she's a wolf. Yeah. I didn't bring no milk bones with me. Hey, Margarita. So, I don't suppose you're a fan of drink. If you gotta have the name, you gotta live up to it. At least have one Margarita a day. <laughs> So, y'all marry? Just ask. He gets a margarita every day he goes home. Lucky dude, huh? <laughs> Alright. So, y'all doing good? We're not going that far. Thank you for, um, choosing me, like, seems like more people are driving these days. Nobody wants Uber. And I guess maybe it's also you didn't read my reviews on me <laughs> really bad. Now, I'm gonna take my time with y'all. Well, with you, Margarita. Margarita. I wish I could make my tongue roll. Margarita. Margarita. All right, Margarita. How many times am I going to say? I didn't say it that time. All right, look at this. And there's a traffic accident day over there. Alright, who's ready to jump out? The brakes don't work. I'm just kidding. That would have been funny. <laughs> okay. Ooh, another one. Wow. Okay. People must be waking up. All right, A little phony baloney U-turn. <sighs> this dude's short. That's not my thing to know. That's too much info. Nobody needs to know. Oh, the task is short. I was thinking like his dinghy, because I saw some sailboats and I thought about. Dingy. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and make this phony baloney turn. I don't care if it is a dude. I'm desperate for customers. Oh, he brought two ladies. Whew. All right, fix my hair up. 
Okay, you can't fix that, and I can't fix my face. I'm just stuck like Chuck there. Oh, hi. You know anybody ever told you... Oh, yeah, what's up, Paul? Don't mean to cut you off. Mr. Garad... Geradio. Anyway. Anybody ever told you you look like Olivia from that SVU show? You don't watch that SVU? Not SUV. It's not a show about cars and trucks with backs on it. No, it's some kind of police show. With this guy that used to play in the show Oz. And he's a good guy in this one. He plays a cop. Anyway. Yeah, look it up. I swear, you could be her twin. What is that red thing? I don't know what things are on my dashboard. I'm gonna call you Olivia. Liv, do you know what this thingy is? It's like a red... Is that air condition? Oh, I need to repair my car. <laughs> what did I do so bad? I just hit a couple curbs couple light posts and a building or two. Oh yeah, don't forget the bodies. I rolled over a few of them. What's the sound of a body sound like under cars? It could it might not have been. It went like doom doom. Does that sound like it could be a body? Could have been a bump. We're gonna say it was a bump. Dude, I dare you do it. He was driving up the wrong way, a schmuck. Okay, I was going the wrong way. Okay, I'm not driving on the curb. Is this the street? It's paved. Okay. Yeah, this is how you beat traffic. Why do people not use this lane more often? Huh. I'm gonna just learn something new about driving today. Secret lanes. Yeah, we gotta go hit the street. Come on, bro. DBV license plate. Ah, oh, look at all the dinghies. You ever seen so many dinghies in one place? <laughs> now that, that there is a set of dinghies, if I ever had to say. Man, they got your big dinghies, they got little dinghies. Just in case you're wondering, I'm not talking about schlongs. I'm talking about sailboats. Yeah, look at them. Yeah, you like dinghies, huh? You into dinghies? Just asking. You might be a dinghy kind of woman. Just let the wind take you away. I learned that from a game called Marine Burst Cup. Now I want to play it. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Oh, man. Alright. I guess this is the end of the, the whole trip. I just really got to know you, Liv. Like, really. I'm gonna just sit here and take it all in and think about our date to get, day together. Not date. Not unless you want to. It's already out there. It's common knowledge. I put it out there. Ball is in your court. And balls can be in your court as plural if the date goes well. So what do you say? You looking at the GPS? We could meet up around here, what you say, at midnight? Or go straight to my apartment. 
You know you don't have a crotch. I've been wondering about that. You just do not use that thing often. They say you, you use it or lose it. You don't use it, you lose it. You definitely lost it. What is going on there? Bro, good luck hitting that. You're going to be hitting the air. I hope mine does. Do you come with crotch? I kind of see it. You're covering it up. No tree trunks there, right? Just making sure it's just not like it's an ethical thing. You have to tell me, you know, you can't hide that thing. If you don't tell me, it's the law. It's like false advertisement, whatnot. That's usually what I do when I get excited seeing a woman. <sighs> Great day. This is probably one of my best rides in a while. I really enjoyed these trips. I didn't think it was going anywhere. I couldn't find any jobs like nobody needed a ride like early in the morning and i was really about to cut it and bam these people came back with a vengeance wanting to you know get escorted i thought everyone bought a car all of a sudden but y'all thank you for watching don't forget like subscribe share let me know in the comments what you thought and I definitely appreciate everyone for um, watching and continuing to support these videos. I have more and more fun every time I play it. Doesn't seem I run out of things to talk about. I sure know how to run my mouth. Anyway, y'all take care of yourselves.